just like my show. <laughs> Good evening, and thank you all for joining us to honor Gloria Day and all the others as they are inducted to the, to the UNLV Fine Arts Hall of Fame. Gloria just left us a few days ago, and we miss her after a, a hundred years. A hundred, listen to that, a hundred years. Pretty amazing. Gloria was so special to Las Vegas. This is the first magician to perform on a world famous Las Vegas strip. She's an icon, not only to female magicians, but to magicians everywhere. She was beautiful, funny, sassy, with always something to say. It's with bittersweet pleasure that I present Gloria with this award for her numerous contributions to the arts and entertainment in Las Vegas. This is for you, Beth. Take this. This is Beth, her caregiver. Anna Rose. We just rediscovered her. Big round of applause for Gloria Day. Thank you all for coming. Thanks, everybody. Gloria is an amazing woman in her era to accomplish what she accomplished in the time she accomplished it. We were kind of saying at the beginning, she held all the cards and she knew how to play them well. When Gloria wanted something, Gloria got it. But she had everything it took to get it with class and successfully. And she was eager to pass what she knew on to others. Hi everyone, so my name is Anna Rose, and now I'm gonna be on the news and I'm gonna be crying, which is embarrassing. Um, so I found Gloria after finding a skirt of hers in a thrift shop two and a half years ago. And I tracked her down and no one knew who this woman was or what she did. And it feels very full circle to me that I can be here standing up with the person that everyone looks up to in magic and be able to honor her where everyone knows who she is. And um, I've been her friend now for almost three years. And I saw her about a week and a half ago. And we were literally talking about what trick she was gonna do on stage next. Um, and that was only a week and a half ago. And um, they always say you're supposed to identify who you look up to in magic. And it doesn't take genius to know there's not a lot of women in magic who do it. And um, I've got really big shoes to fill. And I love to take this story and be able to share what magic really is because magical things happen all the time and this is one of them. So thank you so much, David and um, Beth, thank you. Um, it's been a really special part of my heart. So thank you so much, everybody.